You got my glasses? Yeah. Why? I don't know, just because. Because the sun gets my eyes. You ready? Say, so yeah, I'm gonna go feed the donkeys. I'm gonna feed the donkeys. On my bike. On my bike. Let's feed the donkeys. Let's go feed the donkeys. Hey everybody, Frenchie here. Pretty excited to introduce you to a kid's bike seat that not only looks cool, but it also gets your kids on a bike sooner to go on for rides together. Donkey, donkey, donkey! It's actually been out for a few years, but if you are not a parent, then you probably haven't paid much attention to it. So if you're watching this video, then you probably have children now. So congrats, your life's pretty much over. Shotgun Gen 1 suitable ages for two to five or up to 48 pounds, costs 150 bucks, or you can get a, a handlebar combo for $185. Got full rubber protection for your alloy or carbon frames, adjustable width and angle to fit all mountain bikes. Fixed leg length, and it takes literally less than five minutes to install. I highly recommend if you're gonna go for rides to carry a fanny pack with some tools so you can make adjustments as needed. So what separates this bike seat from the others? I've got another bike seat for my eight month old son on a different bike that attaches underneath the stem and it's this big old backrest. And every time that I uh, pedal, my knee hits the back of the, the seat. So we don't really go on that long of rides where this one makes way more room for my knees so my daughter and I go on for bigger adventures. I don't hit my knees on the seat, and you know it's, it, it really makes it way more enjoyable to go on rides. Now there's this really cool new progression that getting the kids up front on a bike seat then transitioning to balance bikes provides uh, the opportunity to get on a pedal bike without training wheels. I've seen it happen, my daughter actually is, is proof of that, so it's really cool. So visually, most people will look at this and it's, a, it's, a, it's an eye catcher. You know, as we pass by uh, moms and, and grandmas and stuff like that, it just looks funny that your child is just sitting there with no seat belt, no backrest. There's, there's literally just a seat and pegs and they hold on to the handlebars. But uh, it's really good because it also develops uh, a great balance, core, and I like how the bike seats up front too, because they they develop you know depth perception. They see see what's coming at them, and um, it, it really provides um, great foundation for them to transition to a balance bike and then to a pedal bike. So I personally saw this seat and I liked it so much that I bought it myself a couple of years ago. And as soon as my daughter turned two, I stuck her on it. And by age three, we already went to our local bike park in Big Bear and we rode the chairlift up and we rode all the green and blue trails together on it. So it just, it, it, it provides so much more opportunity for adventures and, and going on for long rides and, and taking them out of the house all day and going out and enjoying you know, your local trail network or, or going to the bike park. And, and literally you can travel with this, this seat and your bike and, and take your kids for, for long rides. Ah! <laughs> So visually, it looks a little strange because there's literally just a saddle and pegs. There's no harness, seat belt, a back. So it does look a little strange, but the seat has passed all safety testing to be sold internationally. And my child has actually fallen asleep <laughs> on this seat. Uh, we were cruising down Mammoth and she literally just fell asleep. But what's nice is she's sitting up front so I can cradle her with my arms and legs so she doesn't fall off. She just fell asleep and her 
arms were, hands were frozen to the handlebars. Um, it does get, it does ride a little bit different with, you know, a 30 pound kid on the front of your bike. Um, I would just make sure your, your tires are aired up appropriately. I wouldn't necessarily add any air pressure to your fork or anything like that. I mean, your kid's going to be going on and off. So I wouldn't make too many major adjustments to your bike. So this is the, this is gen one. They also make a pro version that is suitable for e-bikes. Uh, I wouldn't put this on your road bike or beach cruiser. Um, I think that the, the kid's feet would be way too close to the front wheel. Um, I can't recommend this anymore to get your kids out on a bike ride and go, and go on adventures together. Um, if I had to make a, a, a critique, maybe it is the, the saddle size. Sometimes, sometimes I do hit my knees, but it's rare. I could see this being trimmed down a little bit. It is a little bit larger than my saddle, but um, I really don't have too much critiques. Uh, it looks great. It's easy to take on and off. Um, the purpose is to get your kids out on a bike ride together, out for adventures, and I, I can't recommend it anymore. Thanks for watching and we'll see you out on the trails.